And new at 630 this weekend marks one year since a high school student in Murfreesboro vanished. Despite countless tips, Devin Bond is nowhere to be found. News Channel 5's Matthew Torres sat down with his mother who hopes no one will forget him. Like the changing seasons. He's the first thing I think about when I get up. Life for Heather Simmers has brought the brightest and gloomiest days. When I go to sleep, he's the last thing I think about. Her son, Devin Bond, is still missing. His face has covered missing posters, banners, and social media posts since vanishing. He could be around here somewhere. He could be in a different state. I really, I wish I had knew that answer. Devin was last seen around the area of Barfield Crescent Park. It is where search crews combed through the woods when he vanished. Nearly a year later, it's a lot quieter now, but tips continue to come in. I think a lot of people are invested in finding Devin. The student, now 17 years old, left the house on March 31st and never came back. Investigators believe he had a gun with him. He also had just broken up with his girlfriend. Is it possible someone helped him? I believe yes, that is possible. She kept his room intact, but a year proved to be too long as now the family is moving to a different home. I think it would be good for us to kind of start fresh and then when Devin comes home, it will be like a fresh start. A lot of changes in the last year, but this mother's hope has never wavered. I think we're going to find him alive. As she waits for her cloudy days to move away. We love you and miss you so much. We just want you to come home. Matthew Torres, News Channel 5. Investigators say leads come in every week. There's a $5,000 reward for information leading to his safe return. Now, if you have any information on where he might be, call 615-904-3056.